Hey guys, today I'm a little bit close and personal because I'm going to be doing my everyday eye makeup to the easiest face in of Australia highlight and bronze kit on my eyes. It just makes everything so much easier and less hassle. It's just the Glamazon Contour and Highlight Kit in Lepidus. Um, I'm not too sure if it's going to be discontinued or not. This highlighter comes off as a golden tone on me and the contour is like a brownie grey toned the flat shader eco tools flat shader brush and just go into that highlighter shade so go into and put that all over the lid um and you can put it up into the crease a little bit if you want but I just probably put it on the lid so open your eye really wide and then put that in there and this is actually really pigmented to me in real life it's extremely extremely pigmented so oh god I don't know why I do this I always put my arm over my head like this when I do one eye get the eco tools I don't know what's this blender brush thing? put it into the face of Australia the contour shade, um, I just put it straight in, like, and then blend it in like so. Um, blending up as best I can. Blending, blending, blending. My key for this is just blend, 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 and I have gotten in trouble that many times on YouTube because one eye always looks odd, like, different to the other. Like, one eye goes like that, and then one eye with the crease colour goes in. It's just because my um, eye shapes are completely different. Like one eye is like oval almond or whatever you want to call it and the other kind of droops in this weird shape. It's like semi almond and then like if you can see it's like goes up and then it droops down. So I have to try and compensate for that. Um, I don't really put any product on the lower lash line. I don't know why. I just find if you put a bit of mascara on the lower lash I just use the Colossal Volume Express Cat Eyes Mascara okay, brush. I've been addicted to this mascara for ages. And put a nice coat of that on, and I blink it onto the bottom lashes sometimes. Because sometimes, if I put the put it directly on with the brush, it'll clump up the lashes. Whoopsies. Um, and I just realised what I forgot. Okay. After adding the NYX Wonder Pencil in light into my lash line to open it up. Because it just does wonders. So. Oh. Uh, does anyone else's eyes do that? Like, no matter what you do, your eyes always blink when you try and put lower. Like, stuff on your waterline but I'm um, so alright I'm gonna try and do this so I'm on and I find that just opens up the eye opens up the eye and just makes it a bit more uh, awake looking and alive looking so yeah that's pretty much my eye look that I've been going to for the past probably two three months now pretty much yeah I hope you enjoyed this video I hope you enjoyed this video please let me know what your favorite products are to do on your face and your go-to eye look and I'd love to be checking out your eye looks please post them on my Facebook page and my Twitter um yeah I'd love to see pictures of your everyday makeup your everyday eye looks what you do on your face on a day-to-day -day basis whether it's weekend or weekday what you do and I'll catch you on another video soon in a couple of days Bye.